Hey, what's up guys? It's Mr. Yuck and welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use that robot dog ranger. Although I'm on a bot server, everything shown in this video can be used in a regular server. So let's get right into it. Ranger is a call-in. You can call him in anytime, anywhere, as long as the limit of rangers on the map haven't been reached yet. And you can call ranger in as soon as you spawn in the round. The buttons you use to call ranger in are underneath the mini-map. Once you press those buttons, a screen pops up with all the call-ins that you can choose from. And once you pick your call-in, in this case Ranger, a sign drop point will pop up indicating where Ranger's gonna drop. Sometimes you have an issue getting a drop sign point set. And if it's flickering between red and green, just spam the set button. You can usually get the assigned set point to activate that way. And the call-ins will parachute down from the sky. Unless you command Ranger to stay, he will face the same direction that you're facing. Now let's get into Ranger's commands. First off, to use the Ranger's commands, you have to use the comma rows. And the button for the comma rows can be found underneath the mini map too. At the bottom of the comma rows, you can see Ranger's commands and the buttons used for his commands. Ranger, move out to my marker. Inside this box here is what you need to point at the location you want to set for Ranger to go. You have to make sure you got a clear view between you and where you want Ranger's location to be. For example, if a player walks in front of you as you press the button, it is set at that player's location instead of the one that you wanted. Or if you're taking cover next to a wall or a shipping container, the location might set to that wall or shipping container right next to you and Ranger won't move. And another thing you can have Ranger do is self-destruct. And once you press the self-destruct button, an icon over Ranger will start flashing. And once you set a location for Ranger, he will remain there until you call him over to you. So you can use this to your advantage. You can have Ranger watch one area as you're on the other side watching Ranger, another right area. Here. You can have Ranger watch doorways or watching your flanks. Unlike Boris Sentry System, Ranger doesn't highlight players that he's shooting at. Ranger can also use his parachute when getting down from an elevated place. And although he's not very effective, you can send Ranger into combat. Well, that's it for today. If you thought this video about Ranger was helpful, then hit that like button. And while you're at it, consider subscribing. It's free to you, and it helps me out a lot. Alright guys, I'm Mr. Yuck, and I'll talk to you in the next video.